Hey, this is Stoney from My Loud Radio. Make sure you go follow me on Instagram at My Loud Radio. You are tuned in to Hosta Waters. To the newest installment of Who's in the Spotlight. I am the man in myth, the gift. What's the story with T. Moore? And today we are here with the beautiful Stoney of MyLoudRadio.com. We'll be talking with her about some of her passions, her background, and maybe some fun facts as well. With that being said, let's get to it. What's going on, Miss Stoney? Hey, good morning. Um, Thanks for having me. It's so beautiful out here. Absolutely. Um, we're in the beautiful city of Lakewood, Ohio. Everything's groovy like a movie, as always. Um, talk to us and tell the people about what it is that you have going on with My Loud Radio. I have an internet radio station, My Loud Radio, and it's real radio for real people. So it's post- I want it to be a voice for the people who don't get to have their voice heard. So if you got something to talk about that no one else is listening to, I want My Loud Radio to be the place where you can come and someone is listening to you. What, what are the times that the show comes on? Um, my show is Wake and Bake. It comes on Monday through Friday from 9 to noon. And I have a sports show, uh, Sports Talk in the Land with D-Mac, that comes on Tuesdays from 7 to 9. That's awesome. What was some of your passion behind starting radio or getting into the radio game? Uh, I think uh, I just was, I didn't, well, I wasn't serious at first about it. And then when I got serious, a lot of people told me that I couldn't do it. So I guess that's what really pushed me to actually do it. Everybody was like, you can't do this. You can't start your own radio station. You can't do this. Okay, well, then I'm going to do it. Mm-hmm. That's a beautiful thing. Now, what, what makes your show so different from all the other shows that they have going on across the world? Um, I think, like I said, it's real radio for real people. I think it's very raw. The interaction with the chat room is very... It's very interactive, so people get to say what they want to say, and then they I read it, and then they're like, wow, she actually read it. So it's very interactive, and I think that's what makes us different from a lot of other people. Okay. Um, are you a product of Cleveland, Ohio? Yes. Cleveland, Ohio, Shaker Heights, either or East Cleveland. Okay. I'm a mixture of all of them. Okay. Like Baskin Robbins, 13 Flakes. Um, we also have something coming up with um, Rebellious Beauty. Yes. October 1st. It's the uh, rebellious, rebellious beauty fashion show. I believe it's Lena Caldwell Wilson, her second one. Yes. Definitely looking forward to doing that. Um, what are some of your other passions outside of radio? Um, well, I'm writing a book right now. Um, I have I have a lot of things. I, I have so much stuff that I want to do, and I know I'm going to do. So I'm trying to just take it slow so I can do everything. But right now I'm writing a book, so um, I'm sort of trying to get real passionate about that right now but i'm really just trying to help people you know i just want to be able to help people to put myself in a position to be able to help people okay what was some what was the uh was it something that happened or was it just like you woke up and say you know what through all the experiences that happened with me i'm going to write a book um i just think i lived a really really uh crazy life you know so i think i should be able to tell it because a lot of people don't tell their story or you know, I've been to prison before. I've been through a lot of different things, and I want to be able to let people know that even with, you know, having a shaky start, you always can have a better ending and a better finish. That's a great point. Um, what are some of the things you're looking to add to your station? I hear you say you have a sports show coming now. Like, what are, what are some of the people or some of the shows that you would like to reach out to? to bring to my loud radio.com that is right i would like i want a lot of shows i want a sex show i want a bbw show i want a religious show i want a motivational show i want a four guys sitting around like they in the locker room type of show i want four girls like the you know i want i just want all areas covered you know i want an lgbt show i just want everything covered so everyone will feel like they can get their word out and heard what are some of the challenges that you've come across being pretty much the point person and the spokesperson and the only person for MyLoudRadio.com and, and as well as working with some of the people here in Cleveland or Northeast Ohio? I think the, um, the biggest problem I always feel like is just being a woman. You know, I think it's hard being a woman in, in charge. You know, nobody really takes you serious and you got to work 10 times harder 
And if I was a man, you wouldn't talk to me that way. You know, I don't have people would rather do business with somebody who works under me, you know, and it still has to come through me anyway. But, you know, they just rather do business with a man. So I think it's hard trying to run a business and be the boss and be a woman. You know, it's a man's world. So we got to work 20 times harder. That's a great point. Uh, how about like trying to build relationships and, and work with people as far as uh, Cleveland and Northeast Ohio? How does how, how that been coming along? Um, I, I don't know. I don't know if my approach is good. I just always support everybody, you know. Hasn't been getting it back in return, but I don't know. I'm just going to continue to do that. Continue to shop people out. Continue to go to people's events and support them, you know. Hopefully, eventually, it'll come back in return. But until then, I'm just going to keep on doing me. I have, to, I have to agree with that. It's like uh, I love my city, born and raised in the city. And it's like a lot of coattailing, a lot of clicks. And mm -hmm. it's like people who just try to follow the popular thing instead right. of the, really the authentic and the real thing that's going on. So I definitely have to agree with you on that. Um, we're getting ready to wrap it up. Any final thoughts? Uh, sh shout out your social media, the station, and um, any other things that you want people to know that you got coming up. Uh, once again, we are both co-hosting the Rebellious Beauty Fashion Show on October 1st. Uh, in order to listen to My Loud Radio, you can go download Mixler and search My Loud Radio, and you can listen in to all of the shows. You'll get a notification. And um, I look forward to working with Host Hostel Waters, because like I said, I'm supporting anybody that's working, and you guys look like y'all are really, you know, making moves. So... I'm just trying to continue to support the people who are out here making moves and just try to help the community grow. Great point. Well, there you have it. This is Stoney from MyLoudRadio.com. I'm the host with the most. What's the story with T. Moore? Check us out. Hostile Waters, Mars vs. Venus, Who's in the Spotlight. We got so many things coming. What's the word on the street? Check us out. Pay attention. You better do that, do that, do that, that, that. Peace.